Nature Facts The White Belt in the Wild Habitat White belts are commonly found in dojos and gyms, recognizable by their pristine white uniforms and looks of both terror and determination. They travel in packs, often following the scent of sweat and the sound of mats slapping. Behavior 1. Mating Dance The white belt's mating dance involves awkwardly attempting to tie their belt, which results in a complex knot resembling a sailor's nightmare. This display is a signal to higher belts of their need for guidance. Number two, communication. White belts communicate through a series of grunts, heavy breathing, and phrases like, wait, what was that move again? And is this right? These vocalizations are often accompanied by frantic gestures and desperate looks toward more experienced practitioners. Three, daily activities. Most of their time is spent drilling basic techniques, often on the wrong side, and then switching after realizing their mistake. They also engage in rituals such as the trying to shrimp dance, which looks like a fish attempting to flop back into water. Social structure. White belts are at the bottom of the jujitsu hierarchy, frequently seen bowing to higher belts and offering gifts of water bottles and sweat towels in hopes of receiving favor and tips on technique. Predators. One, Blue belts. These seasoned predators enjoy demonstrating their dominance, often luring white belts into complex guards and then submitting them with minimal effort. It's a tough but educational experience for the white belts. Two spazzy fellow white belts. While not intentional predators, other white belts can pose a threat by inadvertently flailing and causing minor injuries. It's a chaotic but bonding experience. Three, the invisible opponent, White belts frequently fall prey to this unseen menace, tapping out to phantom submissions during drilling due to confusion and panic. Defense mechanisms. One, flailing limbs. When under threat, white belts will instinctively flail their limbs in all directions. This often leads to accidental escapes or at the very least, a temporary distraction for their assailant. Two, desperate grips. A white belt's primary defense is to grab onto anything and everything, gi, hair, Matte edges. While not always effective, it shows a tenacity that can sometimes surprise their attackers. Feigning injury. When all else fails, a white belt might suddenly develop a mysterious injury, needing a break to recover. This gives them a few precious moments of peace. Seasonal behavior. During competition season, white belts are often seen nervously pacing and engaging in lengthy rituals involving copious amounts of tape and overly enthusiastic warm-ups. Their bravery is commendable, even if their performance sometimes ends in a series of rapid taps. Conservation status. White belts are an abundant species, with new members joining regularly. Their numbers are maintained through rigorous recruitment drives and beginner-friendly promotions. Remember, the white belt's journey is full of humor, humility, and growth. Respect their struggle and enjoy the comedy of their early jujitsu adventures.